Welcome back to our two-minute devos. We are in day number 14 of our 40 days of prayer here. So we're two weeks into this. If you look in your prayer journals, you see we are in Psalms chapter 62. And if you're looking for a theme, you really get it right off the bat in the first verse. It says, I wait quietly before God for my victory comes from him. Now the key part of that verse is really the last part, the words comes from him. Because that tells us that when it comes to our victory, the victory doesn't lie in us, on our strength and our abilities, doesn't rely on our mentality. If we can think our way out, if we can come up with a solution, then wow, we can get ourselves out of the situation we're in. The psalmist recognizes that the victory comes from God. So you need to understand the psalmist is a general. He is someone that has led uh, troops in the victories, a nation in the victory, and he recognizes when it comes to victory in his life that the solution doesn't reside in him or his abilities. The solution comes from the Lord, and he says, I wait quietly for my victory comes from God, which is why he says in verse 2, he alone is my rock and my salvation, my fortress, where I will never be shaken. And he repeats himself again in verse 6, that God is my fortress, he's my rock, and it's within him I will not be shaken. And in the Hebrew language, that word shaken doesn't mean that we don't go through a time of shaking. What it really means is I will not be toppled over. I will not be overthrown. Why? Again, because the victory doesn't reside in me. The victory, the safety, the security, the strength resides in God. So that's what I want you to stop, pause, and think about today. Have you been relying upon yourself? Do you think the victory comes from you? And I say this. Wait patiently, wait quietly upon the Lord and rest in Him because in Him is all victory. That's all I've got to say today. See you on that and we'll see you tomorrow as we continue through our series.